Chef Joseph. Ooh. <laughs> Leech a little one. Mmm. He already made me my stack because he's so sweet and made mine first. And they were delectable, baby. Oh, I know. Oh, you know? I want to do perfection. Okay, well. <laughs> Whatever. So now, look at that mess he made. Look at that mess he made. And I wonder that's where I was powdering my nose. <laughs> you look silly. Hey, Miss Fox. What do you, what, tell them what you've been doing this morning. They have been begging for pancakes. <laughs> yeah. You you made her bark. I was putting the butter up. What are you talking about? <laughs> okay, so I don't even want to show my face. I look so rough. It is, what time is it? 7.15. We woke up, well, I woke up about 6. I, I went to bed about, I'd say 10. Wait, and what time did you get home? I didn't even ask you uh, that. I fell asleep about 12.45. I woke up about 5.45. Oh my gosh. Okay, so yeah, that is what we're doing. And we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Okay, so Jojo cooks and Stacy cleans up. That's the way, that's the only fair way to do it, right? I'm gonna wait for the stove to cool and then I'm gonna scrub the stove top um, whenever this light goes off, which I don't know if y'all can see that. And uh, yeah, I get all the dishes loaded, let that one soak. Look at my little notepad. Um, I just found it when I was looking in one of our drawers. It says J'adore, or what? Yeah, J'adore. Something in French. What does that mean, y'all? There's a dollar at Target. It's a little sticky notepad. Hey, babe. Hello. You know why you felt better? Oh, tell them you, you felt better, what, 30 minutes after you got to work? Yeah. You know why? Why? Because when I posted the video yesterday, I told them that you didn't feel good. Uh -huh. And asked them to say prayers for you, and they did. Well, thank you. <laughs> Wasn't that sweet? Uh -huh. So that's why you feel better. Look at Mr. Foxy. Oh, I'm full. You want to eat? No, babe, no, I'm full. What'd you eat? Oh. Dang! Well, I only had two and then a piece of a one. Somebody's got a healthy appetite. <laughs> You're so silly. I like to scratch your head. Nah. What are you doing, little miss? Give her a little bite. No, it's got syrup all over it. Oh, Fox. Huh? Huh? And I'm watching, oh, there's Fifi. Say good morning, Fifi. What? <laughs> no, she said good morning. Her said good morning. And I am watching The Biggest Loser, which is on a commercial right now because I didn't watch it last night because I preferred to watch The Bachelor, which was really good. Let's see, holy moly, look at a hot mess that I am this morning. Ah! Oh, and last night I filmed and uploaded my um, final 15 pound countdown, week five weigh in. And so if you want to watch it, go watch it and let me know how you're doing too because I love, love knowing how y'all are doing too. I promise. Um, but yeah, it was a good way in. So definitely go watch it. And um, yeah, what else? I don't know, I think that's about it. I think today we might go for a bike ride. I don't know. Um, I actually asked Joseph uh, yesterday if he would want to start um, going for runs with me. And he said yes. So yay, we're gonna start um, going on walks or runs, you know whatever so that's really exciting and I don't know I don't know what we're doing today really so um yeah we shall see talk to y'all soon bye okay so I have a question to oh, ask <laughs> I have a question to ask y'all okay so as y'all know Joseph has been cooking a lot of breakfast stuff lately and he's really good at it like he's a really good cook and so I wanted to try to cook like a dinner food or something. Yes? Dinner food, yes? Dinner food, yes? No, I'll uh, blow in <laughs> So y'all comment below and make a suggestion of something you would like Mr. Man to cook. What's this? Wait, hang on. Oh, good, where's the um, reaper at? One, two, three. <laughs> That's 
that's weird. Um, so yeah, y'all make suggestions below of what y'all think he should try and cook for like his first meal. Well, you've cooked spaghetti. You've cooked spaghetti. I don't know how to cook. Yeah, <laughs> babe. And he did really good, but that's all you've really cooked, honestly, right? Just spaghetti at one time. And then you cook breakfast. I don't know how to cook. Yeah. Yes, he does. So yeah, y'all comment below on like something he should try to cook. Ah, that would be super fun. Oh yeah, this te television. Uh, I tried watching YouTube on it last night, and it gave me the worst headache. Oh, it was awful. Um, bigger isn't always better. So yeah, I think I'm gonna take y'all's suggestion, and what I'm actually gonna do. And this is the way I had it set up in the first place. This is the matching knot stand to. The bed and then that is actually the matching dresser but this room is so small that the dresser will not fit here like it comes up to like there anyways so what i think i'm gonna do is the only reason i have it here is so that the tv could sit on it but i think i'm gonna take this which is just a random knot stand we got from somewhere i don't know um take this out of here put the real knot stand that goes with it over there and then just leave it like that. So yeah, I think I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, so let me show y'all the few changes I made in here and y'all tell me what you think. So put the little cats thingy right there because that's where they like it in front of the window. And then when you walk in, you see the matching um, nightstand and the Tiffany lamp. Here, let me turn the lamp off so you can see it. There you go. So, yeah, so you see, that's our love box. It has all our love memories, like like notes and cards and stuff like that. And then that has tea light candles in it. And those have been up there. And then I just moved, or I left that knot stand there and just put the flowers that were up there over there. For, and this is just for now, you know. And then the cat's bed stays there. Um, they like the windows in here. So, yeah, I don't know. I think it looks cute. And you can still open the door, which I was concerned about, but it still opens perfectly fine. And from here, you know, you just see that. And for now, there's going to be nothing down there, which isn't a big deal because nobody is ever in this room. Seriously, ever, ever, ever. And I have a laundry hamper if there is a guest or something. So yeah, that is what I did in here. I think it looks pretty cute actually. So yeah, y'all let me know what you think. Hey y'all. Okay, so I'm making lunch right now and I'm making chili and I'm gonna show y'all what I put in my chili. It is like really, really easy because we don't like a bunch of things in our chili. Like, I don't know what people put in chili. What if people put, oh, tomatoes. Like we, we don't like oh, tomatoes. Yeah. Oh. Onion, I don't know. Anything people put in chili, we don't like it. <laughs> so, so we just put. Well, wait, I've got that cube steak that Ruby got me. Babe, <laughs> we are not eating that. <laughs> what is that? There. <gasps> uh, that is so sad. I'm not eating no Baby. Game. Babe, that's awful. If you, if you eat that, you're going to have to cook it when I'm not here and eat it. You know, so I can't take that. It makes me cry. So what I'm doing is I'm browning our meat and then I'll show you from there. And then in case y'all haven't seen my, um, what's it called? My organizing channel, how I organize our cupboard. Here is where I keep all of our, these are Boca clips, by the way. They used to hold your towel on the beach on a chair, but, um, yeah, that's where I keep all of our mixtures, like taco seasoning, chili seasoning. So we're gonna use that one. And what else in here? Pumpkin spice. Ooh, forgot about those. Just add milk. And I also have to add some kind of sugar. Hey, look. What's that? Oh, that's. No, Starbucks was yummy. Stop. And then, uh, let's say country gravy mix. <gasps> Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, y'all. And yeah, that's my little box. What? Don't be mad at me. <laughs> y'all, I just said, I was in here and I said, Chili's ready. And she started going, ah, listen, she doesn't like that. 
Do you not like it when I say that? Chili's ready. <laughs> Foxy. Good girl. Sit down. Come here and sit. Sit. Show your friends you can sit. Foxy, sit. Foxy, sit. <gasps> no, show them how you sit, hon. Foxy, sit. Foxy, sit. Good girl. That's a good puppy right there. Okay, she's such a smart puppy. Okay, so chili is done, and I'm telling you, if it was just me living here, I would have just starved and just slept through lunch. I'm telling y'all, I don't know what's wrong with me. And then Joseph made a new batch of sweet tea, so I have to add the sugar, and oh, that drives me crazy when coffee is missing from here. I know that's really weird, but um, isn't that crazy? What is wrong with me? Am I like a different Martian from a different planet? Here is my Keurig um, collection that I use, ah, that I store all, all of my Keurigs in. So much easier that way. And I got this at, I think, Target? Maybe, no, probably Walmart. I don't know, one or the other. And I just have different kinds of, you know, I have them labeled. And I actually stole this tip from, um, uh, is it organized? Like, I know it's her... The main channel I watch is My Housewife Life, but I think it's Organized Gin or Organized Like Gin. Anyways, um, I took the, the little baggy tip from her, but I put it in this thing because I thought it was a good tip. But anyway, see, even organizing people like me take other tips from organizing people. Okay, so see, all I had to do was find the regular decaf and tea and get out two of the Green Mountain Nantucket blends. And stick those because that's what Joseph drinks. I mean, he'll drink any kind, like this regular. No, not that. They have to match. Um, <laughs> ah, let's see. Yeah. And then when my sister came into town on Christmas, she loves pumpkin spice. I made her a pumpkin spice coffee. So, yeah, I love my favorite lately has been the English breakfast tea. This one right here. And I love hot chocolate yum so yeah i've got to now that that's full i've got to add sugar to the tea and then i'll go see what joseph's doing what are you doing okay. you have to come in here while i'm taking a shower <laughs> i'm gonna i want to ask you a question now don't get too excited but did you know that in less than six hours so Zach's coming on again tonight. Oh, man. oh my God! What the hell is it work? <laughs> <laughs> Do you think you should call in? Yeah, I'll call in. When does it come on? It comes on uh, at seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Yeah. I'll go on in a couple hours and then I'll I'll get sick and yeah, it's a long one. So just play hooky it up. <laughs> so you'll definitely call in sick, right? Yeah. <laughs> Joseph just, just looked at the vacuum and you know what he saw in there? What did you see in the vacuum, babe? A dead mouse. A dead mouse. What color was he? Green. <laughs> he was green. He was dead and he was whole and he was in the vacuum. I think I have some of his brothers around here. Maybe I can show y'all. Oh, yeah, here's one right here. <laughs> He said, how did you make him up a whole mouse? I don't know, he was in the floor, he was in my way. I needed to vacuum you. Hey Max boy, you ready to come in? Say yeah, mama. Hey y'all, oh my gosh. So we are going to um, McDonald's so I can get an iced caramel coffee and y'all. First off, let me say, since now I have two of these, um, what do you call them, neon green sweatshirts, you're going to be seeing this shirt twice as many, and um, yeah, that's a good thing, because these sweatshirts are like, make me happy! <laughs> um, okay, so the other thing I wanted to tell y'all, oh my god, whoa, look at all that cat hair, oh my gosh, thank god I'm going through the drive-thru, because if I was not, I would go right back in, and I would either change my clothes, or I would roll, you know, with the lint roller. Oh, we are sticklers about that. But anyways, um, yeah, so I've been telling you all for the past few days that I've been tired, and I figured out why. Okay, so let me just tell you. Okay, so 
Remember, Joseph started night shift. Well, before he started night shift, he was, and this might not be interesting to anyone. <laughs> I don't know if anything's interesting to anyone, but you know, it's our life, so whatever. But, um, yeah, so before he started night shift, when he had to be at work at, I think it was 4.45 or something, we would literally go to bed about 5 o'clock in the afternoon because he would wake up at, um, he would wake up about midnight or 1 o'clock. That's just his body. That's just how he does. So, you think about it. If you wake up at midnight, by the time it's 5 o'clock in the afternoon, you're going to be ready for bed. So, you know, as you'll know, I'm a housewife. So, I kind of just... You know his habits become mine so we would go to bed about five uh, five or six and then we would wake up or i would wake up about four so you think about it that's how many hours that's a like 11 hours sleep so then you know i'd stay up all day you know have a normal day and then now that he's on night shift um i don't go to bed at five o'clock i go to bed at 10 o'clock but i take my insomnia medicine um yeah, I take my insomnia medicine um, at like 10 because even it, insomnia is weird. If you don't have it, you might not understand. But for me, you can be dead tired and be so sleepy and you just like feel like you can fall asleep. Yeah, you will never fall asleep. So anyways, I take my insomnia medicine at 10 and then I've been waking up when the sun comes up. So I'm only getting like six hours sleep. So that's why I'm so tired because my body went from like a whole lot of sleep to just six hours and I'm the top person that needs a ton of sleep so I'm really happy I figured that out because I was really confused and I was like oh my gosh I don't want to be like this like for much longer so yay for figuring it out woohoo so now I just have to adjust my schedule um but definitely not gonna bed at five because ugh but um yeah so anyways we're going to McDonald's and this is the road that we go down and I'll show you all my coffee when I get it. Y'all, McDonald's is closed. What the crap? They're doing construction on it. And so now I've got... Well, I don't have to, but if I want my coffee, I've got to go to the other part of town and get it. Whoa, this big bump. But here's what it looks like. Construction zone. Okay, y'all. So lucky for me, they weren't closed. They still had their drive through open, but they are redoing the whole store. Which is kind of cool. So there's my medium iced caramel coffee with um, one extra creamer. Okay, so I'm doing the last load of laundry, and Mr. Joseph went outside, and I don't, I do not want, know why I call him that in the videos. Where'd you go? Will you get in the mail while you're out there? Or raise it, and I'll go get it. I want my Netflix. Well, my Netflix isn't coming today. But yeah, I don't know why I call him Mr. Joseph in our vlogs because I do not call you that. Like in person, Mr. Joseph. Oh, oh, excuse me. Our cats are, he spoils them rotten and they like bottled water. Hey. Hey, Punky. Max, oh, Max. Where's that Max boy at? Baby, he's probably in here. Look, come here. I'll show you where he lays. Oh, and that computer that's smoking, we need to get rid of that for real. I don't like it laying in the yard. I mean, yard? <laughs> He's probably napping over there. Um, all those cords, are those all good? Hey, Paul. He's napping. I knew he was. I found last night. Oh, he's so cute. See, that's my bed, Mama. You like the way Mama rearranged your new room? Yeah, I do. So you can thank our friends for that. They gave me the, the idea. Yeah. Okay. I actually love this room now, y'all. I mean, I've always liked it, but... I don't know, it just feels bigger and everything. Me likey. So yeah, Joseph is leaving for work now. And I'm going to um, work on editing our vlog for the day. And add some more milk to this. This did not taste good today. It didn't taste good today. Okay, I'm going to paint my nails. What color do y'all think I should paint them? Because I can't decide. Babe, what color do you think I should paint them? Uh. Pink? Or red, pink or red? White, green, red, yellow, pink. No. I do the direct opposite order on the other hand. No. What color do you think I should paint them? Pink or red? Uh. <coughs> 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 oh, goodness. Uh. Oh. I don't know either. I was thinking I'll wait and paint them next week so they're all fresh for Valentine's Day. 
Oh, uh, nice clean lunch box. Yeah. Okay, y'all. So I'm actually going to go ahead and end our vlog here because I've got so much footage from today and I don't even know if it's random or what. But yeah, so I'm going to end our vlog here. I'm not doing anything else today except I'm going to drink my coffee. I'm going to watch The Bachelor tonight and fold that laundry. So yeah, I will see y'all tomorrow. Don't forget to like the video if y'all liked it. And comment below because we love reading them. And yeah. Welcome all our new subscribers. I think we got like 30 new subscribers last night, which is really exciting. Yay! So, yeah, the more the merrier. So, we'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye! Bye bye.